A third and short for App State. Right up the gut. In a big game for Harrington as they move the chains for a first down. Appalachian State just shy of midfield. A play fake for Thomas. Rolls to his right, looks over the middle of the field, and a quick catch and throw. That should be good enough for a first down. Clark, an Appalachian State Mountaineer through and through. The first-year head coach, Zach Thomas, looks deep. Has a receiver. Caught. Touchdown, Christian Wells. And that was quick for Appalachian State. 46-yard touchdown. He's second and 13. And the fake to Perry. Hatcher to throw right off his back foot. Finds Green over the middle. Key against great corners like Sean Jolly. So here comes the tempo. Here comes another fake. Hatcher going to look deep. And Adams. Adams has his man beat in a big game for Jonathan Adams Jr. inside the 20-yard line. Hatcher, plenty of time, and that is bowling out of the backfield, slides out of bounds just short. Adams in motion, Hatcher rolls right, and he's going to keep it himself, and Lane Hatcher going to pick up the first down for Arkansas State. That's Jones up the middle, and Jamal Jones takes it in for Arkansas State. He knows the unit, he knows the back end. Just needs to buy in now. Harrington off the left side. And Datrick Harrington is going to score for Appalachian State. Touchdown, Mountaineers. 55-yarder. Again, two touchdowns. First two possessions. Thomas, nothing to it. This is we begin the second quarter. And Thomas, much like the last third down, a quick strike, this to Malik Williams. Up in a lot of space around some safeties that are giving him well-deserved respect, an incredible athlete. And here comes the tempo, quick throw to Christian Wells. Sort of that App State attitude that they say, you know what, you're going to come into our house and we are going to get you. Thomas is going to have to roll out. And Zach Thomas can use his feet for a big gain and another first down for the Mountaineers. How Fake. End zone, touchdown. Mike Evans from Zach Thomas. Lane Hatcher in for his second drive. Red Wolf scored on his first one, and Hatcher's going to go deep immediately, and it is caught by Jonathan Adams. So already in App State territory. A quick, they're going to be a double throw into triple coverage, and it is intercepted. DeMarco Jackson. So Foreman on the sideline talking about the throw. Here comes Zach Thomas. He's going to put one deep. And that's going to be picked off. What an interception by Antonio Fletcher. Anything you can do, I'm going to do better. Christian Horn coming across the stream. 14 reads the quarterback's eyes. This ball's underthrown. He puts a foot in the ground, makes an unbelievably acrobatic catch, holds it to his body, and completes it all the way. Should be on top plays on Sports Center. He gets a chain, a belt, and all kinds of fun. Is Logan Bonner back to Adams? They're 28-7. This thing gets out of hand. Nonetheless, here comes Bonner in Arkansas State, able to get the turnover. Bonner's going to have some room to keep it himself. He's not going to slide. He's like, I could play for Appalachian State. Lord, play when it's there, and that time, plenty of room. Well, Tommy Reese calling ball plays for the Irish. Bonner swings it out to Lincoln Perry, and Lincoln Perry to the pylon. Wait for the signal, spot him out. 13 and counting in the second quarter, and it's a keeper for Bonner. Bonner able to shake the defender and then falls down. Louisville, though, if they're going to mess with Clemson. Groupie on for the field goal attempt, and it is no good. He was called out of bounds. Arkansas State went tempo, didn't give it an opportunity to get reviewed. They went loss of down, incomplete pass, missed field goal. And here Appalachian State taking advantage and it's Marcus Williams fumbles the ball after the big gain. And how about this? Another turnover. Staying with the play, sees it all the way, winds up, punches straight through. That's the tone part of it as a quarterback. And they're going to fake it. The pitch falls to the turf, and that was a fake punt going nowhere. Come back to five in the slot.
That ball thrown downfield again intended for Williams. Incomplete. Chandler Staten, 39-yard attempt. And Staten, it's not the way it was supposed to be. Harrington off the left side, avoids a couple of tacklers, and he's going to get a gain of 13. Thomas steps up into the pocket. And there it is, lowers his shoulder, first down, Appalachian State, and the touchdown. Thomas, plenty of time to the left, and a wide open receiver knocked out of bounds. That's Malik Williams. Stack weight on and let go to work. Very honest about this being a developmental program. Thomas to the end zone, what a strike to Malik Williams, and another touchdown for Appalachian State. With Bonner, the fake to Perry. Bonner, a quick throw, pulls it out. Lost yards taken into account. That now puts Arkansas State for one yard rushing on the game, and a good throw there to Corey Rucker. Ball just shy of the 50. Bonner again to throw, has to step up, and a good job avoiding the rush. And Logan Bonner, a couple of nice runs, can gain of eight. My mistake, third and two. And that's Bonner, a quick pop over the middle, caught by number 85, Giles Amos. Trying to make it fourth and manageable here for Arkansas State after the defensive stop. Bonner climbs the pocket, looks to the end zone. And Groupie able to knock the 34-yard attempts through. So Elliot Nimrod set the kick. An onside kick goes the 10 yards. That ball's still loose. We all got it. And it looks as if Arkansas State recovers the onside kick. Ball and great execution on the chip right here. Goes the 10 yards. And then it's a free for all. Now you're at the bottom of the pile. With that for a quick change. Now Lane Hatcher's turn to see if he can dial one up. And Hatcher immediately sacked. Report on Taylor. Hard to block. Saw it there. Hatcher to throw again. Can't find anybody. And again, Hatcher brought down. Receivers, plenty of rushing lanes for Zach. 8 of 11 on third down tonight. Thomas forced out of the pocket. And he's going to be brought down by the Arkansas State defense. Another good stop out of then. Got to help get him open now. He's been on an island by himself. Just two receptions, 31 yards. Let's see if... Logan Bonner can get to him, and how about that? Speak him into existence. Here's Taylor. So second and 10, that's Lincoln Perry, and Perry's able to find some running room off the left side. And how about Lincoln Perry? He's gonna score. This possession after nothing going in the second half. It's Thomas, first play, and a throw to the outside. Caught Christian Horn, You're third and 14. And a designed run for Thomas. He's got the entire middle of the field. What great recognition by Zach Thomas. Is he going to score? Yes. Touchdown. On Fight Island here as we wrap up the third quarter. Hatcher to Adams. That'll be a big game. That'll be good enough for a first down. And Hatcher pulls it out. Pass across the middle, caught by Bowling, and a first down. Play action passes, getting them a look. Tempo here for Hatcher, heads to the end zone intended for Bowling, falls incomplete. They're going to throw the flag. There was some contacts, have another look. Linebacker having a run with the Passing inside of three. Defense, number 52. Arkansas State. And a trick and an end around that goes absolutely nowhere that ends up in the hands of Leroy DeShazer. Be an option, so we'll see what they do here. Third and goal is Hatcher again, has to throw quickly, has a man wide open, under throws him, and how about this? DeMarco Jackson, who was flagged twice on this drive, comes up with the interception. Well, take away the big plays and count on your bodies up front to be able to handle the line of scrimmage, and they've won that battle time and time again tonight. 
and Harrington has all kinds of room. Beating the pulse of the team in his room. Said they're last on the bus stop, but need to be the leaders of the team. There's that shot to the end, and you talked about, and you spoke it into existence. Christian Wells, touchdown. Zach Thomas tossed his fourth. This was one of them. Hatcher to throw deep. Ooh. And it's caught. That's a good pitch and catch there. Back on the practice field a lot later than everyone else. A lot later than their body clock is used to in these instances. We're Clemson last week, Maddie, and they are a buzzsaw. It is amazing to me to watch Trevor Lawrence and his command of that offense and the lead. I just hope, as a college football fan, that we get to see this thing through, start to finish every Power 5 conference, all of these games being played and we get to see some bowl games in a healthy college football playoff. And Matt, you've mentioned it, wanting to see it through, but what we've gotten at the beginning, especially with the delay for some of these conferences, an appreciation for the American, for the Sun Belt, for these group of five conferences that may not always get the headlines. We got the Coastal Carolina Chanticleers ranked this week. Yep. We need to take time to appreciate some of these programs getting more shine because of the landscape.